Juvenile hormone is a sesquipernoid group of lingons produced by the corpa alata that, together, regulate developmental transition in insects. Juvenile hormone was first described by Sir Vincent Brian Wigglesworth as an inhibitory hormone that prevented the metamorphosis of blood-sucking Rodinus prolixus, a kissing bug common to Central and South America. Wigglesworth coined the name juvenile hormone when it became clear that the hormone acted to promote the expression of larval characters rather than to inhibit adult ones. The corpora lata are a pair of organs located behind the central ganglion that synthesize juvenile hormone and regulate its release. In more primitive insects, the corpora alata are located toward the ventral portion of the head, but over time, the corpora alata have migrated to a more dorsal location. Juvenile hormone is not stored in the corpora alata, it is released as it is synthesized. Once the corpora alata produces juvenile hormone, it is spread throughout the insect's body in the hemolymph and circulated through the entire insect and into all the cells. The maintenance of status quo in larvae by juvenile hormone involves both the programming of dysteroid dependent synthesis during the molt and the suppression of morphogenetic growth during the intermolt. Once the process of growth and molting has been put into motion by the molting hormone, the presence or absence of juvenile hormone determines whether the cuticular structures laid down by the epidermis are to be of larval or adult type. Juvenile hormone also inhibits ecdysin, thereby preventing molting and the development of larvae into adults until its level drops just before pupation. Another function of juvenile hormone is to regulate the production of eggs in the female's ovaries. This occurs in most insects. Because mating behavior is often synchronized with the ovarian cycle, it makes sense for mating behavior and pheromone production to be linked with juvenile hormone. In some insects, like the cockroach, this is exactly the case. The early observations of the corpus allotum's effects on the reproductive glands have been extended in a vast body of work that spans most insect species, providing evidence for juvenile hormone regulation in other adult organs as well. All adult tissues that are directly or indirectly involved in reproduction can be affected by juvenile hormone. Juvenile hormone plays a major role in the social organization of bees, wasps, ants, and termites. In social insects, these hormones are also involved in regulating caste development, reproductive dominance, and division of labor. In honeybees, juvenile hormone has been shown to drive caste development in the larval stage, and in adult workers, it plays an important role in division of labor and sensory modulation. Juvenile hormone affects juveniles' progress through their life stages. The corpora lata becomes a trophy during the last larval or nymphal instar and stops producing juvenile hormone. This releases the inhibition on development of adult structures and causes the insect to molt into an adult if hemimetabolus for a pupa if holometabolus. Kopek found that when caterpillars are tied in half and heat shocked, the lower half pupates thanks to low juvenile hormone levels, while the top half does not. Wigglesworth created Frankensteinian monsters in the sense that he decapitated insects and bound them to lower instar insects. When the combined insects molted, both molted into the more juvenile insects next instar. This juvenilizing effect of juvenile hormone has been experimentally verified in Rodneus prolific. Synthetic analogs of juvenile hormone are used as an insecticide, preventing the larva from developing into adult insects. At high levels of juvenile hormone, larva can still molt.